What's happening y'all? Rich Sosa coming back at you with another video today. And before we get started, I gotta say thank God King Jesus for another day and another opportunity. Comment down TG for thank God and where you're tuning in from. And I'll definitely be sure to get back to you with a response. So if you clicked on today's video, as you can see from the thumbnail title and screen bro, today I got a very special lockdown build and it actually does come with a rare build name. So as you can see, it does come out to the versatile stopper. And, you know, I love that comparison of Blazer Scotty Pippen, bro. Now, on top of that one with this build, bro, it has a whole lot of potential offensively. Now, I'm just going to say right now, bro, we do get those pro contact dunks on this build. On top of that, the upgraded passing styles and the upgraded layup style. So, you also get the standing dunk packages, the pro dribble animations. And I think this is truly one of the better hybrid lockdown builds that you can make this year in season one for nba 2k25 on next gen so this build is really packed from top to bottom the finishing is there the shooting of course y'all know i got y'all right but even more so when it comes towards that defense and playmaking side so you know if it's your first time coming through i just want to say thank you for the support i see y'all in the comments going crazy you know i just want you to know that i acknowledge you and i appreciate every single one of you god bless y'all man the rich family so if it's your first time coming through be sure to hit that sub button if you know smash that like button turn on post notifications to be a part of the rich family i'm uploading every single day now from here man let's go ahead and get into the breakdown of today's build so the first thing we're actually doing today is we're going to be making this one out of the small forward position now when it comes towards that height today let's go with 6 8 and then for that weight i'm going to go with 215 now as far as when it comes towards this wingspan today let's go with 7 2 and we are perfectly set to move forward so the first area that i'm telling everybody right now it's always the most important when upgrading any build so that's going to be the physical so, so when it comes towards the speed i think this is probably one thing that a lot of people want to at least have above a 70 or even higher bro but for this one to be more well rounded and to get this build name and still be a threat offensively you need to maintain at a 75 so for that agility we're actually going to go with a 76 when it comes towards that strength let's go with an 85 and then for the actual vertical today we're going to go up to an 80 so these numbers not too bad for the physicals remember you can make your own type of changes and adjustments to your own play style you possibly can't even get the same build name but these numbers i primarily want to focus on getting certain badges animations everything moving forward so let's go ahead and first start with the finishing so with that close shot we're going to go up to a 74 moving into that driving layup i'm going to go with a 75 moving into that driving dunk let's go with an 89 here and then for the actual standing dunk today let's go with a 50 with that close shot being brought up to a 79 so as you can see we actually do get a good amount of animations just from this area so you get those pro contact dunks you also get upgraded layup style so realistically bro cap breakers are going to be great for this kind of build specifically now i'll get into that at the end but as far as when it comes towards the shooting let's go ahead and put that mid-range shot all the way up to an 87 now when it comes towards the three-pointer let's go with a 76 and then for the actual free throw today let's go with a 73 and this allows us to really take this build into any game mode so for that playmaking bro getting into the next area let's go with a 71 for our pass accuracy as for that ball handle today let's go with an 80 and then moving into the speed with ball we're gonna go with a 75 so just from the playmaking shooting and finishing you also get the best jump shots unlocked with these ratings on top of that bro you do get the pro dribble animations and those upgraded passing styles so I think this build is truly one of the better all-around builds that you can possibly make this year and if you're looking for a rare lockdown this build is the one that's got y'all right so let's go ahead and dive into the defensive end for that interior we're gonna go up to e74 getting into the perimeter today let's go with an 85 and then for that steel man i'm gonna go up to e79 now when it comes towards that block today let's go with an 84 and essentially bro this is what we're gonna be able to do on this side of the ball so really super well-rounded build especially when it comes towards that offensive side i think this build low-key may even be better on the offensive side but i love the fact that we do get this you know low-key of a lockdown build name so let's go ahead and check out these badges when it comes towards the actual hall of fame badges we get two of them bro so hall of fame strong handle on top of that you do get aerial wizard so two special badges and i think it does say a lot about this build because the fact that you know aerial wizard that's mainly for a slasher 
and then when it comes towards a uh, strong handle bro this is mainly for a playmaker so to have this kind of defensive build name i think that really you know makes this more unique now as far as when it comes towards these gold badges you get post fade phenom off ball pass and immovable enforcer so this badge right here is probably the most important for any type of lockdown any defender you know this is going to be the most important batch because it realistically allows you to just be a pest on the defensive end you're truly a bully when you have this badge upgraded at its max tier and i think honestly if you were to use this badge on even on silver bro that's going to be perfect now as far as when it comes towards these silver badges you get brick wall you also get dimer paint patroller you know slippery off ball we get post up poet post powerhouse on top of that for the other side we get set shot specialist interceptor on the silver tier bro like i would really consider using my tier one tier two upgrade towards this area to get it on gold and that's going to be butter now we also get challenger from there we get on ball manis unpluckable shifty shooter pick dodger gold posterizer is another really good batch to potentially throw that upgrade towards for the badges now we also get lightning launch dead eye with glove bro so all around, I think this is a solid build from top to bottom. Now, for those bronze badges to wrap everything up, we get Ankle Assassin. You also get Break Starter, Handles for Days, Rebound Chaser. From there, you get Physical Finisher. Now, you also get Float Game, Layup Mixer, Pain Prodigy, Pogo Stick. On top of that, Box Out Beast, Hook Specialist, and then Post Lockdown. So, all around, man, I think this build is going to be able to compete with Guards, Big Man, you know, Lockdowns playmaker stretches this build has you covered bro especially at being at the height of 6 8 i think that's you know a really good starting point to compete with you know seven threes and even you know six ten builds five nines like i think this is a really nice height to go with you're not too tall but you're also not little either bro so let me know your thoughts and opinion on this build is there anything that you potentially would change about it however man i think you know the takeovers are really gonna change how we look at this build so we get about 10 of them so from here man we get above the rim driver fearless focus you also get great wall now just a little tip and hint bro great wall for this build is that's gonna be nasty bro i use this takeover on my personal center man and having anything close to a 99 strength is just super overpowered this year man now especially if you're a big man and a post score you do have a little bit of post control in this build to work with it now you also get mirror you get slice swap specimen you also get new sense midi my estro fortress eraser and also the clinic so you have a lot of options to choose and pick from and i think all of these takeovers are really going to elevate this build to the next level as far as you know for the lockdown area on the defensive side you also get you know badges like eraser to go with that you even get you know look at fortress to be considered for the three pointer and the strength you know it really comes down to your play style your preference how you want to go about today's build making but really take into account using a takeover like let's say mirror bro this is really going to allow you to just be a pest on that defensive end now even if you were to go with you know fearless focus driver that's going to make you an even better finisher bro so all around you have the potential and options to you know mess with this build and change it customize it to your own liking but i think you know truly we went about it the best possible way that you can do so so you know if you have any types of recommendations changes that you would make bro let me know in the comments down below and i'll be sure to check them out from here let's go ahead and move forward to make sure that everybody made the build correctly so number one of course we got that scotty pippen comparison brandon miller and nba champion jalen brown bro so two nba champions on this list and together we have created the rare versatile stopper bro so i just want to say thank every single one of y'all for your support let me know what you think of this build name and you know what kind of builds have y'all personally been making i see when the comments going crazy you know this is probably one of the better lockdown builds that you can make this year on nba 2k25 next gen and if you have a certain build that you want me to recreate or go after drop the details in the comments or you can hit me up on my socials above bro so you know once again i just gotta say thank every single one of you for your support god bless you man you know i got another video dropping for y'all tomorrow and if you enjoyed this one man be sure to smash that like button but you know you can't go wrong with these two comparisons of you know jay brown and scotty pippen bro i think this is one of the better builds that i brought to y'all this year and you know potentially this is going to be a build that you can use throughout the cycle of nba 2k25 so y'all know that i always got to get y'all right 
So once again, thank you, man. Thank the Lord above King Jesus for another day and another opportunity. And if it was your first time coming through, be sure to hit that sub button if you know. Smash that like button. Turn on post notifications to be part of the rich family. And last but definitely not least, with all that being said though, I got one last thing to say. Rich out.